hope they have the camera that I want. Otherwise, I'll have to go to Target. Me too. I hope it does too. Trust me. I don't want to go to another store. I just woke up. I'm trying to talk quietly because Steve is still asleep in the other room. Uh, let's get this day started with a vlog, but before that, I just wanted to sit down and have a little talk with you guys and update you on everything that had happened in the last year and kind of what made me stop vlogging as much. So on August 26th of last year, my mom passed away. She had cancer and it just came on so fast that there was nothing they could do to save her. Um, she didn't get to go through chemotherapy. She didn't really get anything. She felt sick in March and then by August she was gone. It's been so hard on me and all my sisters that it's really taken away from me wanting to make videos. Um, I wanted to do a whole nice video where I sit down and talk to you guys about everything that happened. But it's too overwhelming and I don't want to get upset and have to re-watch it while I edit it, talking about everything that has gone on that's made me feel the way I do. I'm doing okay now. Um, it's not as hard as it was in the beginning. In the beginning it was like, oh my god, I'm never going to be able to move on and feel better, anything like that. Uh, I literally just woke up. So, yes, that is the update for that. Um, also, last year I had posted a video about how I had a tumor, um, a lipoma tumor, in my left buttocks, and so I did get that removed, but he didn't do a good enough job, so it came back. Next month in July, I will be going back to the doctor, and they will be removing it again. Today, I have a thyroid ultrasound for my throat, so I'm going to go take a shower and go get us coffee, and then I will go to that at two o'clock. No big deal for that, I already went once before. They said that I had four to five millimeter nodules on my thyroid gland. So we're gonna see, like you you guys can tell, see how I'm kind of like bigger here, more swollen kind of than other girls, or people, but <laughs> it doesn't hurt. But I guess if you let the glands, I mean the nodules grow too big, at that point it could start to hurt and it could even cut off your air supply so that's why they want to keep an eye on it and make sure that they don't get too big because if they do i guess they remove them so i'm hoping that they stayed the same size since last year when i got it checked but that's what i'm doing today and i am going to take you guys along with me because i really missed all of you so let's go take a shower and go get coffee
trash I have to take out, but I thought I would show you guys as I'm walking out. Hopefully nobody will see me be all embarrassing. Um, but right here is where, oh no, it's raining and I'm wearing a dress. Crap, this was really bad planning. I hope it stops. Crap, <laughs> I got my dress. Um, so yeah, right here is where Steve proposed to me. Um, I put my garbage down. Here's the ring that he gave me. So pretty much right here, we came outside and he said, oh, I loved you for so long. And so I, ugh, stupid trash. I wanted us to stay together forever. So then he got down on one knee and showed me right the ring. And I said, it's beautiful, give it to me right now. And so I grabbed it out of the box and put it on my own finger. Not even like a regular person where you're supposed to like wait for them to put it on your finger themselves. I just got so excited so I took it. So the mission is to get coffee or we'll first throw out this heavy trash and then get coffee. Um, we really love the Starbucks double shots so finally they're in stock at Ralph's over here so I'm gonna go and get those. Ugh, it's heavy. Far walk. Ugh. Trash go. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah. So, this apartment that we're in right now, the one bedroom, one bathroom, you guys have seen it in some videos, but it's so small, and so we applied for another place. And so, tomorrow, I will go look at that place, and I just have to put $200 down to hold it, and then if everything goes through, they will give it to me. So, hopefully, we won't be in this much longer because it is small and we are ready for a bigger place. I made it to Ralph's but I realized I didn't finish my whole story about our engagement so uh, let's see six years ago it would have been 2010 so in 2010 um, I went to Las Vegas because that's where Steve was living at the time we had met when I was 16 years old but then um, yeah, 2010, I went to Las Vegas and we just fell in love. And so since then we've been together and December 4th marks that first day that I went to his house and saw him. So December 4th is the day that we want to get married and hopefully that'll all work out. He has baby fever like crazy and I told him, I'm like, you can't have a baby. You said you want to get married first before we have children. So let's do this. Let's get married. I mean, I didn't punk him into it. I was completely surprised that he engaged that he proposed to me. I didn't know it was coming, so it was very exciting, and we are looking forward to it. Um, wedding planning is really expensive, so I've looked into a couple different options. I really like Inn of the Seventh Ray in Topanga Canyon, but it is expensive, so I looked yesterday at Las Vegas Weddings where you actually get a wedding and a reception there, and it's only like $1,500 for that, and it even includes your flowers, so <laughs> it's a pretty sweet deal, so we'll probably maybe do that if we don't end up saving enough money for the end of the seventh ray wedding, but ugh, I should have put lotion on. <laughs> we are excited. Um, I got this new dress at Fala's. It's right down the street. I got it a couple days ago. It's the first time I was trying it on and I like it. And I wanted to show you guys, but I don't have a full length mirror to show you the whole thing. So hopefully at some point during the day I can catch the reflection of it in something. Um, so we're about to go into Ralph's to get the coffee. So let's go. Need coffee, need coffee, need coffee. Ugh, I probably should take my own bags. I hate taking my own bags inside, so it won't end. In case you guys don't know, in Los Angeles, they stop giving out bags for free and they charge you 10 cents for every bag that you wanna buy. And so I just carry my tote bags with me. These ones from Burlington Co. Factory are the best. They're freaking huge. So I can fit all my coffees and sodas into there. Can we see my reflection in the car? Eh? Nope. Not at all, so we'll just have to wait and find another reflection. The only thing annoying about vlogging is people don't understand it, so when you're walking around talking to a camera, they'll just give you crazy looks, like you're some kind of psycho, but I don't really care, I'm just gonna ignore them, pretend they're not there, now I'm, I'm just FaceTiming on some kind of really strange iPhone, they won't know the difference. So yes, the mission is to get Starbucks double shots and soda for Steve. I drink soda like maybe once a week or something, or if I go out to dinner, I'll drink it, but not every day. So let's go. There we 
always have the most beautiful flowers in Ralph's. Look at these. Gorgeous. Oh, graduation basket. Very cute. What is this? Have you seen it over there? Yeah. Oh. I guess uh, corsages for the prom. Here's coffee over here. Let's see if the double shots are with them. I think they were last time. Five forty nine. Should I get like twenty of them? Let's see. Probably at least four. Maybe five. Five seems like the right answer. Now just to find soda. Plus, it uses color shirt technology to let you know if your I want you so bad, but you're so bad for you. And three forty nine or whatever, it's kind of expensive for gushers. There's only like six packs in there. Good. I have three cases. Should I put all three up? Throw the same flavor. Okay, and then I have five of these. Good morning. Good morning. Are you excited that I went through all that effort to get us the Starbucks coffee that you are now enjoying over ice? Yes, it is amazing. Can't wait. Just woke up. Hi, everybody. Don't you say thank you. Thank you for the coffee. Thank you for my coffee. You're welcome. Take a sip. Tell us how it tastes. You know, it tastes just like it did yesterday. That's good. And it did pour. Yeah, we drank it like almost all the time. Uh, we, we used to go to actual Starbucks, but for me, the white mocha that I always drink, I don't know, it hasn't been very appealing to me recently. So that's why I've just been preferring these double shot drinks. Oh, we are in no way sponsored by Starbucks. We just like it. Steve was just saying how concerned he was that by saying Starbucks we would get copy, or not copyright, and we would get sued for, you know, or whatever. We, our, our video would get flagged for promoting something, but no, you guys saw me go and get the Starbucks and pay for it with my own money. So that's what all the girls say in their videos every time uh, someone like talks about products. You can't even see it, you're backlit. I don't care, I'm not all I'm trying to eat or drink coffee. I know, it's tough. No, it's just annoying. So, when people show products, they just tell their viewers that it's not, that they're not sponsored by that product, that it's just their own opinion and they just bought it themselves with their own money. Like all the makeup that I showed earlier, none of that was sent to me for free, but Urban Decay, go ahead and send me all you want for free. But no, none of it was sent for free. I made it to the, what do they call it, like imaging center. So I'm gonna go in and they are gonna do an ultrasound on my thyroid, which is in your neck. I already told you guys earlier, but I'm here. Ugh, so I'll go in. It's gross, they put like goop all over you and then run the ultrasound machine, like just like as if they were doing it for a woman that was pregnant, they do it on your throat. But they don't tell you right away what they see, the results come from the doctor. So once that happens, I will update you guys. They're looking for my referral right now. The portal kicked her out, so in 10 minutes we'll know if she finds me and they can give me my appointment. They found my work order. So upstairs I go to have it done. I just finished in there. I wanted to show you guys the room, but the technician wouldn't leave, so here I am in the bathroom, and then I'm gonna head home. She just put like blue goop on me and did the ultrasound, and then I wiped it off. That's her banging in the other room. Okay, I'm getting out of here. I'll see you later. I wanted to show you guys my full dress, since I don't have a full length mirror. So, there it is. I had made a whole garden out here and it was very pretty and the flowers are like red and pink and then I put pansies so they're yellow and purple 
and it was really cute but then all these snails kept coming into the yard and or patio and uh, I was sick of pulling them off and throwing them over the fence I couldn't bring myself to kill them I know you can make beer traps and they'll climb in and die but I thought that was too mean so I let them destroy everything and then I stopped watering it so here is my dead garden those were carrots <laughs> this was really pretty but I should have kept watering and I didn't I'll get another one when I move hopefully but I wanted to show you guys look at my one little red tomato out of this whole tomato plant the snails ate every single leaf and this one tomato was on it and it was green before and then I came out today and it's red so from my whole garden <laughs> this is what I got I think I'll take it inside and wash it before I eat it because if snails have been climbing all over it that would be gross to eat let's uh, let's go inside and wash it Okay, I'm gonna eat the one tomato from the plant. It's pretty I'm sorry. firm. I was talking to the vlog. Yeah. Mmm, snails. It's okay, but it's not that great. I mostly want to spit it out. We're walking into Best Buy. Hello. The mecca of electronics. I'm hopefully gonna get a new vlogging camera so that way you guys can get better quality video. What are you getting? Wait to get my TV. Yeah, so we're looking, looking for a new TV and a new camera. I am pumped. I need a front screen. This one doesn't have it. They didn't have a camera that I wanted at Best Buy, but Steve got his TV, 55 inch LED LG brand. So now we're off to Fry's to try to find me a camera that I like. There was a Sony one, but I don't know. I wasn't into it that much for $500. I kind of want to spend like $150. Um, maximum $250. There was a Nikon that was $250, but like, uh, I don't know if Nikons are that great. So we'll see what they have at Fry's. Made it. I hope they have the camera that I want. Otherwise, I'll have to go to Target. Me too. I hope it does too, trust me. I don't want to go to another store. The coolest part about fries is they have all kinds of Alice in Wonderland things. Well, not all fries, but just this fries. But they have her table where she like drinks the potion or something off of. And then they have all these cards that are hung up on the ceiling. And down there is the white rabbit. See him? Steve's taking me over to uh, where the cameras are. He knows where this, where everything is in this place. I love this place. And My hideaway. <laughs> See the cute white rabbit? I don't know why I always just love coming here just for the Alice in Wonderland stuff. Otherwise, I don't need anything. Here, hold my camera and take a picture of me with the bunny. Get, get us in frame. Don't take a picture, but I need that. Thank you. Up there, oh, he's not very clear. Okay, so I found a new camera, I'm gonna get it right now, and then after this, I will put my card in it, if it's charged, and show you guys how much better it's going to be. It's a lot nicer of a camera, trust me. Yeah, you're still like blurry practically in this one. But look at these other cute characters that they have that are super blurry. Yeah, this fries is fun. Oh, and the caterpillar sitting up over there. I got my new camera. Here it is. Um, I have to charge the battery. There was no juice in it at all. So once that charges, the next vlog will be done on this one. It is the Samsung NX20. And it says Wi-Fi on it. So hopefully I can just upload on the computer straight from here. So very exciting stuff. Um, that's gonna end the day for me, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! <laughs>